Hey guys, I'm Tyrone and welcome back to Harrison Family Forum. It is a beautiful Sunday morning here on the forum. I know I tend to say that, but you guys just don't know. Like today's forecast is supposed to be like 80 or something, right? Which is unheard of. It's the beginning of March. And I know I said that even last week we had really nice weather as well. But you should know that in between these two days of nice weather, last weekend and this weekend, we definitely had uh, some type of snow uh, event. So it is it's a up and down crazy thing. So I mention it because I really do be excited. Uh, but neither here nor there. Like I said, it's a beautiful morning. Uh, I don't know what we're going to get into today, but we're going to get into something. Um, first things first. Uh, I just got done making me some coffee. I'll show you guys. Just got done making me some folders here. Uh, and then I'm going to go on to step two, which is getting me some breakfast. Um, so I'm going to get into that, get myself fed real quick. Uh, Angela and the baby aren't here. They're uh, with family in Texas. So I only got to worry about um, taking care of myself. And so with that said, I'm going to go ahead and get that done. Um, and then we'll see what we pick up from there, guys. I'll check back in later. There we go. That's going to be breakfast. Hey, guys, it is actually uh, a little bit later in the day now. It's about one o'clock. We're getting there, um, getting a little bit late start to the day than I initially intended. Um, I mentioned to you guys earlier in the video that Angela and TJ were uh, in Texas with family. And unfortunately, TJ has gotten sick and uh, actually had to be admitted to the hospital there. And so um morning got kind of tied up with talking to them and then uh talking with other family members so yeah i'm getting a bit of a late start um with my day but i do want to go ahead and get outside uh as you guys know typically or you might not know uh typically i start my day or my mornings uh just picking up hay for the uh from where the cows have dropped it within their pen and so that's what i'm gonna do now i'm, I'm actually curious to see just how much waste they have and that's really because um i have a new bailout or fairly new i think it's been out two days now um and i'll be honest it seems to be a bit smaller than the ones i've gotten recently and as uh, i've shared with you guys previously i'm usually uh, i don't have like a what i want to say a, a a normal um hay supplier i'm usually just going on facebook marketplace or on to craigslist to find uh, someone that's got some hay listed at that time and so uh yeah so i say that to say that i wanted to get out here and just see how much they've pulled from it uh how loose it, it looks to be uh and things like that and just because typically i like the bells to be um pretty tight uh wrapped tightly wrapped i guess and um yeah sometimes they aren't and so yeah, it looks like this one is not, and I'll show you guys real quick. So yeah, it looks like there's a lot of, uh, they were able to pull a lot from it very quickly. Um, and like I said, it looks to be a bit smaller than what I typically get. I guess normally I'm getting maybe five by six bills and this is maybe a, a five by four or so. Uh, but yeah. This is what we got, but I got a lot of waste right here on the side, as you guys see. Not waste, it's still in the. No, it's so windy. I'm so sorry. I don't know how this is coming through as far as audio. Sorry about that. But uh, a lot that they've been able to pull out of the bill, and I'm just saying that so quickly, I wouldn't expect it to be uh, that much. And then you see there's a fair amount here as well. Um, let me zoom out. But yeah, so I'm gonna get started getting this picked up uh, and see what we can salvage.
that didn't take too long. But like I said, guys, I'm not that impressed with this bell just yet. Uh, we'll see how long it lasts. Uh, and I must admit, the last bells that I had, I was thoroughly happy with them. And I might just have to uh, reach out back out to that person to see if they have any, any more. I know it, uh, initially when I needed some, they did not. But so, yeah, it just might be a matter of checking back in with them. But on to other things. Still haven't had any luck on Jay as far as getting them sold. I actually um, took some more pictures of them and uploaded those to the listing. And I actually uh, decreased my price, my asking price as well. So we'll see if that uh, causes anybody to reach out um, and kind of just go from there. Yeah, I didn't think it would be, um, I didn't think it would be such a drawn out process especially initially because i did get a call or two um but yeah i have to look at well what my one of the things i plan to do is look at some other listings that are on sorry for the wind but look at some other listings that might be on craigslist and other places and kind of see uh how uh how my list how my listing differs whether that be the animal type or just how they are marketing or, uh, you know, essentially advertising their animal versus how I'm doing mine. And so just might take some tips and pointers uh, or just see if maybe a lot of people just aren't able to sell right now. And I also did do recall that I mentioned that I might look at some, I might look at some of the local auctions. And so I have dropped the ball on that a little bit. Uh, I found one but I just haven't been able to make it to any of their uh, auctions just yet because they uh, tend to conflict with other things I have going on. So we'll see if I can't make that happen here soon. But uh, yeah, I got a few other things I need to check on real quick and then I'll touch back in with you guys a little later. Hey guys, just wanted to check in. Uh, still Sunday today is getting away from me. Um, I ended up having to work today. I had a, uh, a estimate appointment with a potential client, so that took some time. And I just realized that I am out of dog food. Well, I just remembered that I'm out of dog food. And so uh, I'm gonna run to Walmart real quick because it's a little bit close to the Feldman's and I'm not necessarily going for some feed at the moment either. So, um, yeah, I'm gonna run up here to Walmart, grab some dog food, try to make it back to the farm, uh, see if I can't get something done around there. It's not looking great. It's already pushing four o'clock, but we'll see how it goes. Uh, but I'll check back in with you guys a bit later.
Hey guys, so yeah, I'm back from uh, Walmart and just really getting around to doing what I need to do for the animals this evening. Uh, the sun's beginning to set. I don't know if you guys can tell. But yeah, sorry today's video wasn't as eventful. Uh, my day kind of had a few things that kind of threw me off, of course, with uh, TJ being sick and then in turn being hospitalized and then also my customer wanted to reschedule for today because their original appointment in the week wasn't going to work. Um, so yeah, it kind of knocked me off track and took, and kind of just knocked my day off from what I initially um, envisioned what today would be, but it happens and that's all right. Um, Out here looking at these cows, they think it's time for them to get some feed. And I guess they would be right. And there's Beyonce. I guess they're not too bad of a group. They put up with me, I put up with them. Maybe I should've went to Feldman's. Let me get them, uh, start getting my feet together. Hey girls. Hey. 
guess I will I don't even know which I can see right now. I didn't realize the wind caught the phone. Thank God it didn't blow over. These ghosts do not know how to play nice and shit. They doing better now. But they was just trying to hit with each other. But y'all doing things so out of order. Usually, I would have picked up the cow's hay first, but I didn't even think to do it while I was over there. So yeah, I'm gonna go back over here, pick this hay up uh, like I did this morning and actually bring some hay over to the goats. It's like they were pretty much um, out of any good hay that they had over there. So getting them taken care of and pick up this stuff these cows dropped. Not as much as it was this morning and actually not, not as much time has passed by, um, but they're just working on that bell so, so quickly, at least it seems to me. Um, yeah. A lot faster than I would like, I'll tell you that much. All right, guys, so this is the hay I got for the goats for. I'm going to take over there to the goats. Most of this I uh, accumulated this morning, not this evening, just now. Uh, but, yeah, we'll take it over to them and see if they think that they uh, were short on hay to begin with. Since I was just walking right by here, uh, these bales of hay, I figured I'd show you guys the other two, uh, of course, from the same place. Um, it looks like decent hay on the inside, no doubt. They're just a little bit smaller than what I would have liked and seemingly wrapped a little bit looser, but I don't know. It could have been just that one bell. So we'll see how the rest of them turn out, but just so you guys can see them. Uh, yeah. Well, yeah, I'm not going to complain too much because they were, actually got me or I was able to get out there to them in a very clutch time. I was completely out. And so it worked out very well. And so, yeah. But anyway, let's get the, the goats there, hey. Oh, sorry. Hey y'all, so we got the ghosts taken care of. They got the hay, whatever they needed. Uh, and I was able to, obviously I'm back inside now. Uh, so yeah, the animals are good. I also got a call from Angela and an update on TJ. He's doing a lot better. Uh, still in the hospital for now, uh, but definitely uh, turning things around and, and looking like he's making a great comeback. So hopefully uh, we'll hope we'll be seeing him be released soon and then them being able to travel and return back home. So. 
prayers up for that. And yeah, guys, <clears throat> I'm about to um, get me some dinner going. Um, I thank you guys for hanging out with me today. Be sure to leave me a comment down below, like, subscribe, and I hope you guys have a wonderful week and that, uh, yeah, go after what you want. Peace.